guidelines on processing, compatibility and the rules of food consumption. Today I am going to show you a recipe from the South Canara which is based on the Shamidhanya Prakara from the Charaka Samhita. For this I am going to take the 5 types of the pulses, each of half cup, tuwar dal, black gram dal, lentil dal, moong dal and bengal gram dal means chana dal. Clean it properly by washing with the waters at least for 2 to 3 times. Throw out the muddy water and put the new fresh water for soak. My dal is clean, now I will add the half teaspoon of the fenugreek seeds to it which will give the good digestion of the protein also. Now I will add the fresh water also and let it soak for minimum 4 to 5 hours. Soaking of the pulses as well as slight fermentation of the food helps for the proper digestion. Also it lightens the food and make it fluffy which is easy for the digestion. Ayurveda has clearly told that pulses should be consumed in the moderation along with the pungent thing, fats and the salted thing. Doing this helps for the elevation of the vata produced by the proteins. Check the softness of the dal and add a few curry leaves, 2-3 green chilies, an inch of ginger, 3-4 garlic cloves and the complete dal step by step. Don't waste the water because this water contains much nutrition. Make the smooth paste and thick paste. Don't add the extra water unless very much needed. Add half teaspoon of turmeric, a teaspoon of the salt. Whisk the batter vigorously till it get fluffy at least for 10 minutes and then rest for 1 hour with cover lid in. The dal get automatically fermented and lighter after this. We are not adding any leavening agent in this. Now for making the said dosa, take a pan or the tawa, make it heat properly. When it is heat, pour a 1 to 2 spoon of batter, sprinkle some oil over it and cover with lid. Let it cook for at least 1 to 2 minutes or till the vapors stop coming. Now turn over the dosa, sprinkle once again a little oil over it and let it cook till golden brown. Make all set dosas with a similar process. This will make a soft, spongy and porous type of the set dosa which is very tasty and very good to look. To digest the protein easily, I am going to add the one component which is prepared from the ginger. There are two types of the ginger chutneys which will add in the digestion. Let us see the recipe. First spicy ginger chutney. For this I am going to take the two inches of the ginger, going to cut it finely. One tomato I will also choply rough that. A few a half cup around the pop chana dal or the roasted chana and 2-3 to three red chilies, 3-4 three to four cloves of the garlic. Heat tawa or the pan on the gas. Once the oil is warm, add 1 teaspoon of the cumin seed, 2-3 to three red chilies and few curry leaves to it. I take out little seasoned oil with the chili for the garnish. Now add the ginger and garlic, cook it for some time. Once it is cooked, add the tomato, red chilies and the roasted popped chickpeas to it. Let it cook for some time. Once it smells aromatically, then remove from the flame. Add salt to taste, a pinch of sugar and then churn in the mixie when it cools properly. Add a little water while churning in the mixi and adjust the consistency according to your need. Pour the paste into the seasoned oil and the chutney is ready. For another sweet ginger chutney, take 1 inch to 2 inch of the ginger, grate it or chop it finely. Take a small size of the tamarind 
pour a warm water to heat and soak it at least for the 15 minutes in another pan take a small quantity of the oil when it warm add two red chilies a little bit sesame seeds and the cumin seed and few curry leaves then add ginger and roast it till it get the brown color remove few curry leaves and the seasoning in another bowl for garnishing once this cool churn it is in the mixer is the dry powder now squeeze the soaked tamarind and remove the pulp from that add this pulp to the dry powder which is already roasted and let it cook once again add 1 tablespoon of the jaggery 1 teaspoon or salt to taste make a sauce like the consistency and your chutney is ready now garnish the dish and enjoy it the two types of the ginger chutney improves digestion it improves the oxygenated blood supply to the organs and this helps for the absorption of the proteins and other nutrients from the gut there are other health benefits also please watch the video for the same thank you for watching